This video is entitled Arteries to the Head and Upper Limb. We're just going to go ahead here and draw a very simple heart. You can see this is not anatomically correct. From the heart, we'll draw the arch of the aorta. The arch of the aorta has three main branches, so this is asymmetrical at this point. The first branch on the right is the brachiocephalic trunk, and you'll see we have the left common carotid and the left subclavian arteries. The brachiocephalic trunk needs to divide so that we do get symmetry. So here we have the right subclavian and the right common carotid arteries. Each of your common carotid arteries is going to divide again, and that's what the word common will tell you. So as you can see here, we're going to have the left internal carotid, right internal carotid, left external carotid, and right external carotid. And I just abbreviated those for simplicity on this diagram. Coming back to the right subclavian, we know that the right subclavian becomes the right axillary, which then becomes the right brachial. And the right brachial will split into right ulnar and right radial branches. From the left subclavian, you will have the exact same pattern. 